time again, Superintendent Eddie Johnson has blamed Chicago's violence on repeat gun offenders. Today, he revealed he's working with legislators to take action. CBS 2's Sandra Torres reports. Gun offenders get slaps on the wrist in this city, and it has to stop. He said it before, but today, police superintendent Eddie Johnson stressed the urgent need for stricter sentences. We've had police officers attacked three times this week, being fired at. Just by the grace of God, they're all here to tell the story. That's ridiculous. Just this morning, someone fired shots at a district commander in the city's South Chicago neighborhood. Among the five arrested, a repeat gun offender. This is exactly what I've been talking about. When you don't feel the penalties for the crimes you commit, why would you stop committing them? The superintendent then highlighted the case of Jeremy Terry, a 21-year-old convicted felon who pled guilty to a gun charge earlier this year. And instead of ser serving his sentence in jail, he was recommended for boot camp. Three months later, police arrested him again with another illegal gun. He just doesn't fear the consequences of his actions because he knows when he goes to court what's going to happen. Slap on the wrist. That's why Johnson says new legislation is in the works. If you pick up a gun, pull the trigger, and kill somebody, I don't care how you're wrapped, you should go to prison for it. Superintendent Johnson says he's been working with lawmakers on legislation that will bring stricter sentences, and he's optimistic about change starting in January. Live in the newsroom, Sandra Torres, CBS 2 News. Erica. Okay, Sandra, thank you.